Demand for managed futures has grown in recent years. Here to tell us about some of these trends, Paolo Farone, Thomas Saldana and Manel Sarabia. Paolo, let's start with you. Tell me about some of the asset managers you attract. Well, Nostuki was founded in 1964. and is one of the largest independent and most respected wealth management companies in Europe. We have pioneered the concept of choosing the best asset managers to deliver the best returns, developing tailored solutions for both our private and institutional investors. To work with us, these managers must satisfy our strict due diligence criteria, including operational risk assessment, on-site visit, and ongoing monitoring process. All of this independently from portfolio management and reporting directly to our chief risk officer. Okay, so how important is international expansion to your company? International expansion is extremely important uh, to us. We are fully equipped for pan-European distribution. For instance, Nostuki Europe was the first management company in Luxembourg to be granted both the USITS and the IFM extended licenses, enabling us to offer specific bespoke services to our private and institutional investors. For instance, being a one-stop shop, for fund engineering, EU distribution, and a robust risk management framework. And so what new products have you introduced since 2010? We have collaborated with talented asset managers to create several innovative new products, systematic CTAs and longshore funds, as well as uh, expanding the selection of our usage for funds. All these products are really important to us. We are uh, trying to develop our business beyond our own boundaries in order to better respond to our clients' needs. All these innovative new products are helping us to achieve this. So, Manel, tell me about how the demand for managed futures has grown in recent years. Well, professional asset managers know that the most efficient way to improve their profit risk ratio of a portfolio is through diversification. That is by carefully introducing new assets with a, um, a strong uh, fundamentals, but at the same time, and that's the, the most important factor with a good correlation with the rest of the portfolio. Managed Futures offer exactly that and using them allows the investors to uh, reduce their exposure to risk, increasing uh, returns and therefore improving their efficiency. In these well diversified portfolios, Managed Futures offer an attractive, consistent and well correlated return over time and I think probably that's the main reason why they have grown significantly over the last decade. So how do you rate your CTA? Well, as for the results, uh, we are uh, reasonably pleased because in, in relative terms, Capitrate is always among the, the, the best funds in its class. And in absolute terms, uh, uh, since our exemption in May 2008, we have achieved uh, an annualized return of over 12.5%. On the other hand, uh, it's also important to highlight that uh, our worst year during that period was only minus 2.17%. And I think that uh, it shows the, the ability of the fund to preserve capital even in adverse times. So, Thomas, what is the difference between the Capitrade CTA and other solutions available? It's difficult to answer these questions without analyzing what the competitors are doing, as we don't have enough data to do that. But the key factor is to have a team, and we have it, with the talent to find the right combination of strategies to control simultaneously the risk and correlation between the assets in real time and to continuously improve the model, but maintaining a very skeptical attitude to any possible improvement. However, if we speak about the main difference, it is transparency. We offer in our website to investors in real time all the information about our fund. And this is something our competitors are not doing at the moment. So, Manel, generally speaking, what is the management model for your CTA? We are uh, trend followers. Uh, the model has a, a systematic approach, is 100% automated and offers uh, daily liquidity. Diversification is, a, is an important factor for us and the model is designed to invest in the most important sectors of the economy, which are uh, global stocks, interest rate, energies, uh, currencies, uh, metals, uh, soft and grains and meats. The fund only invests in, in future markets, electronic and organized future markets, with uh, high liquidity levels. And regarding uh, strategies, uh, we use uh, short, medium and long-term strategies, and the fund takes and changes positions uh, gradually from long to short and vice versa, depending on the, the current trends. Finally, risk control is an essential part of the model. We want to keep the, the volatility of the fund within a very narrow range between 13 and 17, and our goal is 15. 
And for that reason, all the processes um, that we previously mentioned are subject to, to that target. So tell me more about your investment process. As for the investment process, the, the key word is, is neutral. It is neutral because we, we all know that markets uh, will provide us with trends, but we don't know when and we don't know where. Therefore, uh, our asset allocation in terms of risk uh, should be as neutral as possible. And for that reason, when we, when we have to determine a position in a specific market, we need to consider three very important factors. The first one is the, the signal strength, that is the, the position of the strategies. The second one is the volatility of the market where we are going to, to change our position. And the third one is the, the correlation uh, of that market rela relative with, uh, with other markets. Whenever one of the more than 700 strategies that we have implemented in our platform changes its positions, immediately the, the platform calculates these three factors and launches orders to the market adapted to the current market situation. So tell me about your ambitions for the future of your companies. Tomas, let's start with you. At CM Capital Markets, we wish to continue growing in asset under management and developing new quantitative 100% automated models using the technology and knowledge we developed in the CapiTrade CTA. In fact, in the next uh, few months, we will launch a new fund that is currently in managed account format. It is a smart beta that invests in European equities, adding a hedge with derivatives that will reduce uh, the risk in case of adverse events. We hope it will be as successful as uh, CapiTrade CTA. And Paolo? Well, globally, Nostuki will continue to position itself as an asset allocator with an eye for selecting talented asset managers who share our values. Besides increasing our presence in Europe and in Switzerland, we will keep on um, exploring for new opportunities in growing markets. We can take advantage from our size, international presence, and a fully regulated organization in order to support our strategy. Our European private client base remain the key focus for Nostuki. Being the first management company in Luxembourg to be, to be granted the dual uh, usage and IFM extended licenses, and also being a FEMA regulated asset manager, puts us in a commanding position in order to better respond to our client needs. Paolo, Tomas, Manel, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you.